Welcome back, guys. Welcome back to another video. Today, we are going to be doing the NBA Tournament Pick'em Challenge. As you can see, you make it all the way up to the very finals. Now, uh, I think I'm going to be making multiple of these if you can. Because, you know, I'm not the brightest human on the planet. Um, so, yeah, guys. We're going to be starting off with these games. So, whoever wins this game... Uh, well, you can see right here under the Denver Nuggets. Um, you can see Minnesota and Oakland. Now, I do think Minnesota is a great team, and I do think they're gonna win that game. Um, but I don't think they're gonna have uh they're gonna have enough momentum to win against the Denver Nuggets, which are the number one seed in the nation. So we are going um and. So as you know, you they have to win um they have to win multiple games. Um I think I think they will win. Now I do think Minnesota might win a couple games, but I don't think they'll win um oh I don't think they'll win a lot. So I'm gonna go with them winning five games. They're not the best team. Um they're not the best team on uh in, in the NBA right now, but they're a good team. Uh now Phoenix Suns. I think they're gonna make a run for it. Uh that's just in my opinion. Um they're a great team. Devin Booker has been tremendous for them. Uh but yeah, I'm doing this off of no statistics, off of no roster or anything. So I'm just open minding. Now the Los Angeles Clippers, I have no idea about their team. I have no idea um, about their team at all. But I do know that Phoenix, the Phoenix Suns, are a better team. I do know that. So in that case, I'm going to pick the Phoenix Suns. And yes, they won't win every game. Yes, it does say 84% of a win chance uh, of um, round one fan picks. But I'm going to say they're going to win four. All right, this game is going to be a very close game. It's going to be a very, very close call. But uh, this is what we have so far. We got Denver and Phoenix playing each other in the semifinals. So now we got... The Golden State Warriors, which are my favorite team, so I am probably going to be a bandwagon about them, but I do not think they will make a run. They might win one game out of the series, but I don't think they'll win that many games. Uh, so, yeah. Um, also, this the game under the Denver game, those are the playing... Uh, those are the playing... Um, the playing brackets. Um, so, we got Sacramento... Good, good team. Good team enough to get the number um number three um seed in um in the Western Conference, but I think they will lose. I think they will lose. Golden State has been a, on a hot streak. Stephen Curry has been um the whole roster has been back. They got Stephen Curry, Jordan Poole. Um, they got that um I forget his name uh. I forget his name. Uh, that one, uh, orange hair kid, Golden. I, um. So yeah, guys. Also, uh, um. I forget his name. Uh, um. Don Dante De Vincigo. Um. Sorry if I pronounced it wrong. They got Andrew Wiggins, Clay Thompson, Stephen Curry, and Clay Thompson. Um. The three point trio. They got Demont. Um. Da um, Damian Green, uh, and they got uh Jonathan Kaminga. Um, they also got Conve um Convon, uh Lon Lonely. Um, I just think they have a better team. They have a better coach, and overall, I think they will pull off the first upset in this battle. And I don't think that uh they will uh um. No, I think yeah, you can change it. Um, now the Memphis and Lakers game. Now let's talk about the Lakers. They barely made it into this tournament. They barely made it into this tournament. Let's just hear it all, and that's 
and, and that's what, you know, LeBron James, a.k.a. the king of basketball, uh, don't think he's the GOAT of basketball. I think Michael Jordan is the GOAT of basketball. Um, so in that, um, in that reason, uh, Memphis, um, I, I did went to one of those game um, to one of their games last year, uh, versus, uh, shoot, I forget their team, versus, like, uh, the Pacers, so, Men- Memphis plays good, as long as they have, uh, as long as they have, uh, uh, Jackson, uh, whatever his name is, Jackson Jr., uh, the and John Murray and uh and uh the um their center I forget his name uh but yeah as long as they have those three healthy through the whole season um I think I think they're good I think they're good uh Steve Adams that's who it is Jaron Jackson Jr. Steve Adams. Uh, even if they have like Dylan Brooke and John Murray, I think they're going to make a run in the tournament. Um, so yeah, in that case, I think they're winning. I think they're blowing it out. They're 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 winning every single game. Uh, they're not losing um a game against the Lakers. Um, maybe one, maybe one. Yeah, I'll just go with one. Um, but yeah. Now we have uh Milwaukee. I'm um, gonna try to keep this sh- um keep this fast and running. Uh, now the only big thing I would change is um them because I don't think the I don't think the Heat or the Bulls have a chance of doing that. So yeah, boom, 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 ba boom. They're not blow them out. Uh, so yeah, Celtics. Uh. New York Knicks, uh, don't really know how their team is. I'm just going to pick upon the fans. That's going to be a close one as well. Brooklyn versus um, the 49ers. I would want to pick uh, the Brooklyn Nets, but I do think um, the f- um the, 40, um, the 79ers will get it done. They have a great team. Uh, and also, the Suns. Have Kevin Durant. So, yeah, they're definitely making a run. So, yeah, in that case, I'm going to pick uh, South um, uh, Phillies by what, what did I pick? Hold up. By five. Boston versus Atlantic. I'm not even going to say anything about that game. I, I know that game's going to be a blowout. I know that game's going to be a blowout, so I'm not going to say anything about that game. Now we got the semifinals, Denver versus Phoenix. Man, man, oh, man. I did say to my brother that I think Denver will might make it to the finals, but as it seems here, I think Phoenix will go to the conference finals. And that's my bold point. But it will be a hard fought win in five and five wins. Five wins. It'll be a hard fought five wins. So yeah, that's that that's what I'm thinking. Hard fought hard fought five wins. So yeah, now Golden State versus Memphis. This game, I have been wanting to see my entire life. Golden State versus Memphis. They probably it's probably already happened. Uh, wait a second. Does this mean? Oh, this means, but they will win. And because, so I'm getting this all wrong. Hold up, let me let me change this. We'll make it uh them uh, yeah we'll actually stick it here boom 
Wait, what was Manifest? Yeah. That would be seven, this, six. There we go. All right, there we go. So, yeah, I think this will be, yeah, five. Um, so, yeah, Golden State versus Memphis. I think Memphis will lose. Oh, no. I think Golden State Warriors will lose. Memphis have have had an extending um, extending, uh, season, uh, but I do think it'll be a hard-fought win, so I do think it'll be in seven, uh, I, I, I don't even know how to put it, Celtics, I haven't seen, I haven't seen them play one game, so, um, yeah, Boston and Philly, <laughs> I think I think that would also be five wins there for them. Now we got the conference finals, guys. Phoenix versus Memphis. Phoenix versus Memphis, guys. You know, you know, I've been wanting to say this my entire life. But I do think, I do think that Memphis... Will go to the finals in a f hard fought victory uh, against the Suns. This game, this game will be the most funnest game to watch. This game, this game versus Phoenix and Memphis, it will be the most March Madness game ever, bro. Oh my goodness, I cannot exclaim to you how hard this game how hard these two teams are going to fight to get into the finals boston versus um versus the bucks now the bucks then they, they won two years ago boston celtics they went to the finals last year i think they were the number two seed last year too or maybe even the one seed last year but i think i think they will make they will make a comeback and they will come back they will come back to to the finals with um with they will come back to the finals with in 5 games the finals the NBA finals presented by YouTube TV this is my bold prediction, my YouTube prediction on what, uh, on what the finals will be this year. Now, Memphis and Boston, both great teams, both, both, uh, uh, um, both outstanding teams, outstanding teams. Hold up, I gotta, I gotta go. Both at, uh, um, both outstanding teams, out. Standing teams. Both outstanding teams. But I'm going to say. I'm going to say. That Boston. That Boston. Will have. A comeback run. Yes. Yes. And also, don't even, don't even get me started. Don't even get me started. When I said it was in the middle of the season, I said Boston was going to win the finals. I said that the Boston Celtics were going to win the finals. And I'm going to put that down here. This game is going to go into seven games. Seven games exactly like last year. The tiebreaker for this, everyone knows there has to be a tiebreaker. Tiebreaker for this is going to be what will the point the point margin be in the in game one of the NBA finals? The point margin will be it will be a hundred and 
185. 185. That will be the tiebreaker. Is 185. Submit. And that is my... Uh, and that is my... What is this? Oh, boy. Oh, boy. So, yeah, that is... That is my uh tournament bracket challenge. I'll hope you guys to see it in the next video. And I'll uh, say so long. Peace out. Bye.